Halo Mas. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. Hello dear. How are you, Han? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Lamor, how are you, Lamor? Mas, this is what? Math question. Math question. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. Okay, Ham, so Lamar, Omar. Where is Abdullah, Yara, and Aisha? Where are you? Aisha. Hi, Miss. Hi, dear Yaro. Can you open your camera? And Omar Abdullah, I need you all to open your camera, please. Can <laughs> show? Okay, Sam, Alaikum, Rahm, Tolay, Barakato. How are you, everyone? I'm Miss Rasha. Inshallah, we will start in teaching math. Okay, I will start in teaching math this year for you. Uh, first, I need to see you all. Please turn on your camera. Uh, okay. Here. Uh, Okay, this is Omar. How are you, Omar? How are you, Miss? It's fine, Alhamdulillah. Uh, and Jana, Reem, where are Reem? I still. I need you all to open your camera, please. Let's start. Okay. Now we will start first by recognizing our uh, uh, rules in our classroom. We have here some rules we need to know about. Um, we need to enjoy our session. So we have here some rules we uh, we can see. Uh, first, I need you all to be on time. Each, each session, inshallah, uh, be ready before the session and be on time. And here we have to act like a school we have to sit uh, in a quiet place we have to get our uh, get uh, our stuff to start our session um and uh, you i need you uh, to sit in one spot during the class we will not move uh, during our class we will sit in one spot please all the time keep your keep yourself muted uh when i when i ask you a question you can open your mic and, and answer me and if you need to ask question or you need to talk, uh, you can raise your hand. Uh, and here, please turn on your camera all the time. Please turn on your camera. I need to see you all. Here, we have to listen to our teacher. And please try no eating during the class. And then have fun and do your best. Inshallah, we all uh, will have fun. 
and we will try to do our best. Okay. And uh, now we, we will we will play first. Who who like to play? Who like to play with me? Uh, who like to play? Uh, I see Ali. Me. Yes, Ali and me. Yara Lamar. Yes. Jana, I need to see you, Jana. Your uh, your camera. Turn on your camera, Jana, please. Reem and Joyria. How are you, Joyria? How are you? Alhamdulillah. Okay. Let's let's see here. We will play. Okay. Now I have a spinner. And this spinner will, will 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 turn, and I need you to choose a question. Tell me stop when you choose the question. Tell me stop, and then you will answer this question. Okay? Now who will start? Um, I see all of you raising your hand. So Ali, start Ali. I need to see you, Ali. I, you are you're opening your camera, but I need to see you, please. Uh, yes, that's that's fine. Okay. Uh, open your mic, Ali. Yes, that's yes. good. Now I will spin. I will spin uh, uh, Ali, and I need you to tell me stop. Okay? Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Ah, quickly. When I can stop? Uh, stop. Quickly, Ali. Where are you? Huh? Stop. Okay. Ah, yes, here. I need to to know about your favorite game, Ali. Which what uh, what is your favorite game? Which game you like to play? Uh, let me see. Huh? I have okay. uh, I have uh, two best game in my life. Let me see. Again, you you have two. You have two. Can put it in my chat because I want I don't know what to say. Because if I, I say, I, I need you to tell me what is your favorite game. Now we now we, you get a question and I need you to tell me what is your favorite game. This is a question for you. I need to know about you, and I need to tell me what is your favorite game, Ali. You are you are uh, you like to playing with your mobile. You like to playing with the ball. Uh, what is your favorite game? Okay. Huh? Football. You are playing Ali, right? Football. Football. Okay. Okay, that's good. And yes, I will, uh, yes. hmm? yes. I will send you something in the chat, okay? Okay, okay. I will say. Okay, Ali, okay, I will not say. I need you Ali, to send me Please meet your show. Uh, okay, now I need I need Lamar. Lamar, open your mic, Lamar, please. Okay. How are you, Lamar? Now I will start the spinner. Okay. Alhamdulillah, okay. Now I stand for the spinner and I, I need you to tell me stop, okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. ah, quickly. Stop. Stop. Mm. How can you spend your weekend? Uh, at the weekend, what are you doing? Weekend. Hmm. What are you doing? You go to the garden, you go to your friends. What are I, you doing at the... I play with my friends. Okay, that's good. So Lamar play with her uh, her friends at the weekend. That's good, Lamar. Okay, mute your mic, Lamar, please. And Joyria, now it's your turn. Open your mic. How are you, Juju? Are you fine? Alhamdulillah. Okay, here. Now let's 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 see your spinner. I will spin and and tell me stop. Okay. Stop. Okay. Yes, your favorite sport. Huh. Are you playing sports, uh, uh, Joyria? Uh, I, uh, I I yes. Um. Huh. Like uh, you like swimming, basketball. Which sport you like? Swimming. Swimming, okay. And now it's the intern. 
Dim, open your, your mic. How are you, Dim? I'm fine. Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah. Now I will turn your spinner, uh, uh, Reem, okay? Okay. Mm. Can we stop? Stop. Mm, stop? Okay. Yes, now Reem will ask a question. I need you, Reem, to ask a question. Maybe you need to know something for, uh, uh, about your teacher. Uh, you can ask any question now. This is your turn. I don't know. You don't know any question? Yes. Okay, do you know my name? Do you hear my name at the beginning? No. Okay, I'm Miss Rasha, Reem. I'm Miss Rasha. And I will start teach you, uh, teaching you English. Okay, uh, sorry, math. <laughs> okay, Reem? Okay. Okay. Right, now it's Yara. Yara's turn. Mm -hmm. Let's go, Yara. Teacher, can I answer? Who's talking? I am Omar. Okay, Omar, Hi. one minute. Hi, Yara. Yara first. Yara, Yara, stop. Can I stop now? Yara. Yara, where are you? Yes, I'm here. Huh? Tell me stop. Okay. No. Again. Hmm. Your favorite sport. What are your what uh, what is your favorite sport? Nothing. Nothing? You, you don't like to, to okay, we will change the question. I will spin again and tell me stop, okay? Okay. Okay. Huh? Stop. Are you sleepy? Yara, are you sleepy? Wake up. Are you sleepy? No. Stop. Okay. Uh, stop. Okay. Uh, how can you spend your weekend? I watch TV. You, you, uh, you, you are sleepy in your weekend? No, no, I huh? watch TV. You watch TV? Okay, yes, okay. So Yara like to watch Teacher. TV at the weekend. Now we, I need Omar. Where are you, Omar? I'm here. Yes, okay, Omar. Now you're, it's your turn, Omar. Okay, well, I will spin okay. now, okay? Hmm? Okay. Stop. Ah, stop. Okay, your favorite place, Ya Omar. Which place you like to go? Um, the swimming place. Hmm. Okay. You like the beach? Yes. Okay. That's. Nice. Okay. Now I know about you, and I uh, I'm happy to work with you now. Let's see. Miss, I didn't answer. Who's talking? Farida. Oh, yes, Farida. I'm sorry, Farida. Farida. Sorry, Farida. Oh, yes, I hear Farida and Abdullah. Okay, Farida, tell me, Farida. I will spin and I need you to tell me stop. Okay, Farida? Okay. Huh? Stop. Mm, stop. Okay. Again, your favorite place, Farida. Which place do you like to go? My favorite. My favorite place. My favorite place, Flagio. Hmm? Uh, this is a, a kid's area. Is this a, a garden or or is that what? What this place, Farid? Uh, yes. What this place? It's Can you tell mold. me more about this place? Mall. Yes. Good. You like to go there? I like it because uh, uh, the flag you has so many things. I, I like it. Oh, yes. It's very good. Wonderful, Farid. Okay, now it's Abdullah. Where is Abdullah? I can't see you, Abdullah. Where are you? Abdullah, are you here? Abdullah? Yeah. 
Where are you, Abdullah? No one here. Okay, what about Aisil? Aisil, hey. Aisil, you need to open your mic, Aisil. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Aisil, need open her, Aisil, you need to open your mic. And we have here two hams. Hams, where are you, where are you, where are you hams? Can you open your mic? I'm here. Okay, now it's your turn, Hams. Okay. Favorite. Okay. Favorite. Stop. Okay. Yes, it's your favorite sport. Do you like to to uh, to play sport? Um, I love jumping. Jumping. Yeah. Wow, that's good. You have the rope to make jumping? No. Huh? Okay. Okay. Okay, that's good. Now we can start. Okay. Today's session is our something called ratio. Something called what? Ratio. Okay. I need you now. Now I need you to answer. It will repeat after me this word, okay? I need to hear your voice, okay? Ratio. Ah, I can't hear you. Ratio. Open your mic and and and, and repeat after me. Ratio. Ratio. Term the ratio. Antecedent. Consequence. Again, antecedent. Antecedent. Look, look at this one. This one. Antecedent. Yes, antecedent. Antecedent. Consequence. Consequence. Another time, antecedent. Antecedent. Consequence. Okay, try to repeat, to, try to, to remember this word. I will ask you about this word at the end, okay? Let's see now what is this word and what's the meaning of the ratio, okay? Okay, first we need to, to, to see this video. This is a story. Maybe we can understand what the meaning of ratio, okay? Explore a few solutions. Grammarly suggestions catch when you're. How do you? Bye. 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 Ratio and Bye. its Bye. applications. In this module, you will learn about ratio, equivalent ratios, and some applications of ratio. Now, this is, this is the story will start. Mom, I'm thirsty. Please make a glass of orange drink for me. Okay, Vinay. Wait, Mom. I want to see how to make it so that I'll be able to make it for my friends when they come in the evening. Mom, how did you know what to add and how much? It is written on the bottle. To make a glass of drink, Take one cup of orange squash, pour it into a glass, add three cups of water to it. You can hear the story, right? Yes. And then mix them well. Your drink will be ready to serve. Mummy, please make one drink for me too. Now, how will you add the squash and water to make the drinks for both of us? See. To make it for one person, we have to take one cup of squash and three cups of water. For two persons, we have to double the quantities of both the squash and water. That means we need to take two cups of squash and six cups of water. Okay, that's fine. We will stop here with this with this Think video. If I okay, the video is talking about. When I need to make something like juice or uh, or a cake or something like this, we need some cups of 
water and some cups of uh, uh, um, something like flour or fruits or sugar. Okay, the number of cups, let's see here. Back to our PowerPoint. Means consaic, that's good. Look here now. Miss, can I drink water? Ah, oh, yes, quickly. Quickly, please. Okay. Okay, Yaro? Okay, now, look at this picture. What is this? Can you see what is this? Ah, what is this? It's, uh, who can tell me? Who can tell me? Yes, Ali, open your mic and tell me what is this? Yes, it's cookie. Yes, it's cookie. Do you like cookie? Yeah. Okay, me I too like cookie. It. Yes, okay. Now to make the cookie, we can we can add two cups of flour and one cup of sugar. Okay. So I have number two for flour and number one for the cups of sugar. When I ask you about the ratio of flour to sugar to make the cookies, I will say it's two to one. That means I need two cups of flour and one cup to of sugar to make, to make what? To make the cookie. So I can write the ratio of these numbers like this. Two, two, one. That means this is a relationship between these two numbers. This relationship, how many cups of flour I need to the sugar to make cookie, okay? Okay. Now, if I start by sugar, now I start by, by flour. So I said that I have two cups of flour to one cup of sugar. If I started now by the sugar, I can say that I can use one cup of sugar to two cups of flour. Okay? Okay. Now we can see this fruit stand. And I need who will answer Farida. Can you open your mic, Farida? Yes, yes, miss. Okay, Farida. Now we have five apples and three oranges. Okay, Farida. Okay. When I ask you about the number of fruit, uh, the number of apples to the number of orange on this stand, uh, fruit stand, huh? How can I say it? How can I say the ratio between five? Uh, between apple to orange. How can I write it? Now I started by saying apple to orange. So I will, I will start by number one. Huh? How many apples here? Well, uh, five. Five, yes. Five. five. Two. How many orange? Three. Three. Okay. Yes, yeah, three. Now, I need to tell you something. I can write this this ratio by another way. I can write it like this. I can write it. It's five over or divided three. That means the ratio means division. The relationship between the numbers by using division. The relationship between the numbers by using division. I'm talking now about the fruit stand. I'm talking about the fruit, the, the apples and the orange. How many apples and how many orange in this fruit stand? What is the, the amount of apple to the amount of orange? I have five apples to three orange, okay? So it's five to three or five over three. Is it right, Ali? Yes, miss. Uh, is it right? It's five to three? No, not right. Uh, not right? What, what, what is the right? What is the right number they can write? Now I, I said to you, apples to orange. Apples to orange. I started by apple. The number of apple is five and the number of orange is three. So it's five yeah. to three. That's right, Ali? Yeah. Okay, what's your opinion, Omar? Omar, are you here? Yes, teacher. Huh? Is it right to say it's five to three, the number of apple to the number of orange, five to yes. three? Yes. Okay, so, Okay, Omar, if I started by the number of orange to the number of apple, Ali, what I can say? 
Yes. Ah, tell me, I need now to say the number of apples to the number of uh, the number of orange to the number of apple. The ratio of orange to apple. Now I need the ratio, but I started by by the orange first. Huh? Uh, three to huh? Three to five. But now I need Omar to talk. It's not your turn, Ali. Please, a bit yes, to please. Omar. Yes. Hi, Omar. The number of orange to apples. The number of orange to apples. How many orange here? And how many apples? How many orange here? And how many apples? Oh, yes, but, but I need you to look at the screen first, Omar. You can see three? the picture here. Yes, it's three, three and five. I will not see and I will not say three and five. I will, not, I will say three, two, Over. five. Three, three, two, five. Five. Repeat after me number three. Okay, three or five. Not five, dear. Three to five. Three to five. Yes. Teacher, and we can say and what about over? Hmm? Yes, that's and right. We... we can say three. Super. Over. Super Omar. Three over. Five. Over five. Ha, ha, Hannah, tell me, Hannah. Is this right? Omar's answer yes. is right? Yes, that's right. So I can say it's three, two, five. That's good. Let's clear and turn to the next one. Okay, now we have strawberries and orange. Who likes strawberries? Who likes strawberries? Lamar, do you like me. strawberries? Not me. Please, no, I okay, like strawberries. I'm... Okay, okay, Hannah. And what about you, Lamar? Do you I like, like it, Miss. Miss me too, okay, I like Farid. it. Okay, Farid. Hey, Lamar. Lamar, open your mic, please. Teacher. Yes. I don't um, love the fruit. Okay, Omar, I can hear you, but I need you to, to take care for, uh, of our rules. We said that if we need to, to tell the teacher something, we, we have to uh, uh, raise our hand first, right? So please, yeah. if you need to talk uh, to me, Omar, raise your hand, okay? Now you will mute your mic, and I, I know you are super students. Thank you, Omar. Hi, Lamar. Lamar, tell me, how many strawberries here, Lamar? Can you see the number of strawberries? Uh, let's take count together, Lamar. Uh, one. Sorry for this one minute. Yes. Uh, Lamar, count with me. Uh, one, two. Uh, one, two. Three, four. Uh, three, four. four, four Five. Listen. Five, yes. Six. six. Yes, I have six strawberries. And how many and how many orange? Three. Three. Let's get, yes, three. One, two, three. Okay, okay, Lamar. Now I need you to ask you a question, Lamar. Read the question here. Can you read this question first? Okay. Read. Hmm. The issue. This is the word that we read at the beginning of uh, Lamar. Repeat after me again. The issue. The issue. The issue. Yes, that's right. Huh? The issue. Of strawberry to orange. Yes. Yes. The ratio of a strawberry to orange. Which word we start with Lamar? We start with a strawberry or, or orange? Strawberry. Yes, we will start with the number of strawberry, okay? So how many strawberries we said? Six. Yes, yeah, six. So we have to start here by writing six, our ratio. Huh. Two. Two what? How many orange? Three. Yes. So the relationship between strawberries and orange here is six. To three, the ratio is equal six to three. How can we write it with another way? Yeah, do I read it? 
Han Jojo, can you tell me how can we write it? I need another way to write this ratio. Now, uh, Lamar said six to three. Is it right? Okay, Jojo, that's right. Can you tell me how can we write it with another way? Three over six. Yes, super. Long of it. So, okay, we can write six over three. Okay, now I need Hannah. Can you tell me if I started by the number of orange, the ratio will be, if I tell, if I, if I ask you about the ratio of orange to strawberries, how can you tell me the answer? If I started by the number of orange. Uh, hmm? 3.6. 3 over 6 or 3 to 6. Repeat again, Hannah. I can say three over six. Three to six. Huh? Yes, three to six or three over six. That's right. Okay, thank you. <coughs> now, who is here? Hans, where are you, Hans? Miss. Yes. What the difference between uh, miss you? Ratio uh -huh. uh, yes. and the friction. The same. same. The same, dear. When I say when I say the, the friction is the relationship between two numbers. And here what this is what we are talking about. The ratio means the relationship between two numbers by using division. You know that the friction means division, right, Hans? Yes. Yes. When I say it's two over th uh, three, that means two divided three, right? Yes. Yes. Yeah, so the same here of the with the ratio, we can we can we can uh, um, tell the relationship between two numbers by using this ratio. When I when I talk about uh, um, an amount or an a number or a number, we can say we can use the ratio. Okay, Hans. Okay. Okay. Now, can you tell me the ratio of basketball to the soccer four? I have here. Yes. Five. five. And two. How many soccer balls here? Eight. It's five, huh? two. Two. Eight. Yes. Super. Five to eight. Okay. Five. Five over eight. eight. Super hands. Five over eight. Okay, Abdullah. Are you here, Abdullah? Okay, Yoro. Yoro, can you hear me? Yes. Yes, yes, Yara. Huh? What about what about this answer, Yara? Now Ham said that the ratio of basketball to soccer balls is five to eight. Huh? Is it right? Yes. Is it right? Yara, yes, that's right. Okay, Yara. What if I started by the, the uh, by the soccer balls? If I told you about what is the ratio of soccer balls to basketball? Eight uh, over over five. Yes, it will be eight over five. Can you open your camera, Yara, please? Okay, son. Okay, so it will be eight over five. That's right, Yara. Jazakallahu khairan. Now, let's see. I have another question. We'll clear my board first. Okay, now look at this schedule. Here you can see the forms of writing ratio. We have many forms to write the ratio. As we said before, we can write it like this, three to six, and we can write it like this, three over six. And here we can write it by words. Three is two six. Three is two six. When I, when I, when I read this one, this numbers by this way, I can say, Three is two six. Now look at this ratio. It's three over six. I have the ratio of apple to mango three over six. Who can remember how can we, how can we make this fraction to the simplest form? Do you remember the simplest form? Huh? Do you remember? Oh, uh, I need uh, Joyria.
Joere, can you hear me? Joere is not here, it's out, okay. Okay, now Ali, open your mic, Ali, please. And I need you to open your camera. Omar, please open your camera. Please follow the rules. I need you all to follow the, the rules. Don't close your, your camera during the session. I need to see you all, please. Keep it open. Yes, thank you. Lamar, I need you to, to open your camera. Thank you. Jazakallah khairan. Here I have two Yaseen. Assalamu alaikum, Yaseen. Yaseen, assalamu alaikum. Okay. Okay, now, uh, Ali? Yes. Ali, uh, um, at which grade you are, Ali? You are in grade four or five or six? Four. Four, okay. Can you remember, Ali, how can we make this fraction at the simplest form? Yes. Okay, let's see. Now I need this fraction equal three over six. When I make this fraction to the simplest form, I can say it's equal what? Huh. First, what I will use to make the simplest form, I will use multiplication or division or, or what? Huh. Uh, I have number three and number six. These two numbers, I can make them smaller, right? I can make these two numbers in this fraction smaller. Who can remember how can we make this? Ali, can you remember? Ali, I know you opened your camera, but I can't see you. Please, I need you to sit properly and open and, and, and I see you. Okay. Place your device in front of you, please, Ali. Uh, tell me, Ali. Now, I have number three and I have number six. I need a number divisible for these two numbers to make a simplest form, to make these numbers smaller. Uh, who can remember? To make uh, Hannah, six can you remember? smaller? To make six smaller than three? Yes, I need number three and number six to be smaller. I need the simplest form for this fraction. Uh, can you remember? Five. I, I, will tell, I will tell you something easy, Ali. Now I will use the division. I, I need to divide number three and number six with the same number to make a simplest form. Which number I can divide it for three and six at the same time? Uh, uh, number, number three. Th three. Three divided what? I, I will say three divided what? Huh? Three divided. Huh? Three divided. Huh? Let's kind of drink water. Okay, Farida, quickly. Three divided huh? what? Okay. Three divided one, I will get the same number. I will get three, but I need to make this number smaller. If you say three divided one, I will get three. It will be the same. Okay, Ali, I need you to, to uh, I, I need you to listen, Ali, I, I know you can't remember, but I need you to listen to me, inshallah you will remember this, okay? Okay. Type, okay, who can answer? Lamar, Hannah, Farida, Farida drinking water, Omar, who can answer okay. this question? To make Omar. the simplest form for this fraction, I need to remember smaller. Omar, you can remember, yeah, Omar? What? Picture. Yes, open your camera and tell me. Can you remember? Okay. Yes. Huh. Tell me, uh, what can I do? Now I have three and six, and I need to make these two numbers at the simplest form. Which and number I will divide it by three? Uh, which and number? This is the time, simplest form for this section. Okay. Two. Open your camera, yeah. Uh, two. Okay, I can use two. Okay, what about number three, Omar? Yes, I can make. I can use number two to divide it by three. Can I make 
Can I say three divided two? Look here, Omar. Can I say uh, three divided two? It can be. It can be. It can be. Three divided no. two can be. No, can't be. So no. which number I can use? Huh? Uh, three. Three is the same number. Yes, I can. I can use number three because number three is divisible for three and six. Okay. Yes. Okay. So here I can say. Three divided three and six divided three. three when divided I say three divided three, three equal what? Three divided three okay. equal what? Three divided three. Equal? Uh. Uh, three divided three. We can. Uh, okay, uh, Hannah, can you answer me, Hannah? Open your mic and answer. Three divided three. Three. Equal? Three. three. How come three divided no. three equal one? Uh, huh? Three divided three equal one. Yes, it's equal one. Three divided three equal one. Which number you will multiply by three to get three, Omar? It, it will be one, one. right? Okay, one. now can you tell me, Omar, six divided three equal what? Six divided three. Hmm. Uh, equal two. Equal two, yes. So the simplest form for three divided six will be one over one two. two. Yes, one over two. So these two fractions are equal, three over six and one over six, this is two equivalent fraction, okay? Okay. So when I get the, the, the fraction um, at the simplest form, I have to use division and I have to use a number I will use with numerator and, and I, will use, I will use with denominator to get the simplest form for the fraction, okay? okay? Okay, now who likes to play? Me. Who likes to play? Me. Okay, let's, Me. are you ready? Are you ready? Yes. Ah, are you ready? Yes. Okay. Uh, uh, Sandy, salamu alaikum. Salamu alaikum wa barakatuh. How are you, Sandy? I'm fine, thank you. Okay, alhamdulillah. Uh, uh, Sandy, uh, in which grade you are, Sandy? Yeah. In which grade you are? You are in grade four or five or six? Four. Four, okay. So are you ready Miss, to play, Sandy? Miss, Miss yeah. Miss. Huh? Yes? Miss, why you don't ask me and Hams what you read? No, I'm asking. I'm asking when you answer the question, I will ask you. Okay. Now, are you ready to play? Yeah. Yes, me. Okay. What is me? What is my name? I will tell you now. This is not the play. I will say. I will say you. What is the? What is the game? Now I will tell you. What is the game? <laughs> Miss, what is this? Sandy, you need to mute your mic. I will mute it for here. Yes, now we will go to play. Hmm. Okay, now we have a spinner here. Can you use the spinner? Okay, who, who, is, who is ready to answer? Who is ready to answer? I need a hand. Yes, Miss. Hey, can are you ready to answer? Okay. Okay. Now look at this. Look at this question. I I spin here, and you get this question now, Ham. Can you tell me four to three? This is the this is a ratio. 
four to three. And you know that the, this ratio means four over three. It's the same, right? When I say four to three, it's the same. When I say four over three. Over three. Yes. Is this the simplest form for this fraction, uh, uh, Hans? Or we can make it smaller? We can make this number smaller or this is the, the, the simplest form? I don't understand. Okay, now we, we, we are talking about the simplest form. At which grade you are, uh, Hans? Hans? Yes. Uh, where are you? At which grade you are? I need you to tell me at which grade you are. Um, you are in grade four, five, or six? Four, four. Huh? Four, yes. Okay, so last last year you with with you took the friction, you, uh, you took the fraction, and you know how can we get the simplest form for this fraction? How can I get this number smaller? Like we said, when when we talk about the uh, the fraction of three over six, when we say three over six it was equal one over one two over right two. yes one over two that's right hand yes okay now can you tell me about this fraction four over three or four to three this ratio how can we how can we make it in the simplest form or this is the simplest form already can we make this number smaller or it's small, this is the, 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 the simplest form. Huh? Look at this fraction, huh? three over six. We can make it smaller like this, like this and it, it become one over two, right, huh? Okay. Okay, now I have four over three. Can, can I make it smaller? Or this is the simplest form already? <laughs> Uh, yes, it's simplest form, right? So I can, uh, yes, it's a simplest form, right? Okay. Okay, that's, that's okay. good. Thank you, Hans. So when I have four Thanks. over three, this is the simplest form. I can't get a number uh, uh, to make it smaller one, or to make a simplest form. One over two symbol. Yes, here, one over two. It's a simplest form for three over six. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. Okay, Hans. Okay. Thank you. Okay, Hans. I get it. Okay, dear. That's good. Alhamdulillah, Farida. Yes. Let's play Farida, okay? Now I'll, I'll spend my spinner now, Farida, okay? Okay. I will clear the, the board first. Can you, can you put the game in the chat? Oh, yes, I can put it in the chat. Okay. I will do this. One minute, Farida. I will try to um, put the link for your friends. Okay.
Now I copy the link for you. Miss, do, do we have to open it? Yes, I need to open it and try to play, okay? Now I, I, will, I will make it for Farida. What's wrong? I I play. I play. First, I need you to close your your, your, your mic. Only Farida will open her mic. Okay, Farida. Let's let's see Farida. I will spin it now. Okay. Okay, this is the same question, Farida. Huh. Okay, now I ask you another question, Farida. In the simplest form, four to three. What does it mean of four to three, Farida? How can I write it with another way? This is a, this ratio, four is two, three. Four is two, three. How can I write it by another way? Can you tell me, Farida? Huh. Open your mic, Farida. Now open your mic to answer. When I say four to three. Yes, miss. Huh, how can I write it? I can say four to three. Four is two, three. And I can say, I can write what? What I can use? What is the other shape? For the ratio. Huh. You remember? Oh. Hmm? Let's see if I here. Point. Let's see this schedule here. Yes, look at this one, Farid. We said that we can write the ratio like this. Look here. We can write the, the ratio like this. Three is two, three is to six like this. And we can say three over six like this. So we can use both, both of these forms, okay? When I say four to three like this, when I say four to three, how can I write it, Farida? Four to three. This is not the ratio. Now, if I write three to six, I can write it three over six, the same, because this is a division. So how can I write four? Four, four is to three, Farida. Huh? Uh, uh, first is three is four, then if, uh, a line, four. then a yes, three. We, we, Yes, so yes, I can say can four I over the, three. Can I go to the toilet? Okay, Farida, but I need you to listen one minute. It's four over three. Repeat after me, we can say it's four over three. Okay, Farida? Huh. Repeat, Farida, four over three. Four over three. Yes, yeah, but four is to three. It means four over three. Okay. 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 Now can I go to here? the toilet? <clears throat> yes. Now, but please quickly go to the toilet. Okay. I need to tell you something here about this numbers and then the name of this numbers. We can we can call these two numbers three and six. We can call it terms of the ratio. We can call it what? Uh, we can call it what? Open your mic and tell me, all of you, open your mic and tell me. This one called number three here and number six in this section or in this ratio, we can call it terms of the ratio. Be, repeat after me, terms of, of the ratio. Terms 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 of the ratio
Turn the the of the the Yara, open your camera, Farida. Okay, Farida is not here. Yes. Turn the phrase. Huh? Where is Omar? Where is Hana? Ali? Yes, Miss. Hana more. I need you to repeat after me. Turn the phrase. Term of ratio. Term of ratio. This, this two numbers, we call it terms of ratio, okay? Okay. okay. Now, I need to repeat after me because we will pay now again. Okay. Pay after me. Okay. Term of ratio. Term of ratio. So these numbers, we call it this. Okay, what about this one? This is the first term and this is the second term. This is the first term, number three here up, we call it the first term, and number six will be the second term. And here the same, I write three first, so it's the first term, and then this is number six, it's the second term, okay? Shama? Yes. Listen to me, Shama, okay? Okay. And open your camera, please. Okay, Simsim? Okay. Okay. Open your camera. And Hannah too, why are, you, why are you closing your camera? Omar and Hannah and Ali, where are you? Yes, thank you. Okay, thank, thank you for your call. Okay, now I will tell you about the name of this one. We said that this is the first term and we call it antecedent. We call it what? Antecedent. Antecedent. Again, antecedent. Antecedent. Again, antecedent. Antecedent. Hams, why are you why are you uh, um stop talking, Hams? Repeat after me, please, dear. Antecedent. Antecedent. Okay, thank you, Omar, for repeating. Okay, and now the second one here, the second term, we can call it consequent. 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 Okay. Again, consequent. Again, consequent. Yes, listen to me again. Consequent. Consequent. That's right. So the first term, the number we write before here is called antecedent. Antecedent. Repeat again. Antecedent. Antecedent. And the second one here, the second term, we call it consequent. Okay. Consequent. So this is the two terms of ratio, and the first one, which we write, before, which we write first, it will be antecedent, and the second one will be consequent. Okay. 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 Now we have here another game. Let's see this game now. We will play this game and then back to our lesson. Okay, who will play with me now? Who is who are ready to play to play? Me. Uh, Okay, um, Yoro, are you ready, Yoro? Yes. Okay, now look at the question, Yoro, and read this question. The first term of the ratio. Yes, the first term of the ratio. Huh? What is this ratio Three here? Seven. Three over seven is what? Huh? What is the first term? We have here two terms for this ratio. What is the first Three. term? Yes, super. That's good. Okay. Now, um, another question for for Ali. Are you opening your camera, Ali? Yes, you are open. Huh. If Ali, a can you read this question? Yes. Yes. If a is happy. Happy. You know what the meaning of have? 
Yeah. Okay. So then A to B. A is 2P equal what? When I have A, it's half B. A is half B. So the, ra the ratio will be 1 to 2 or 2 to 1 or 2 to 3. Which one is right when I have what? A? Huh? What? To two. Super. One to two because A. Because one. A and what? A two B. A C yes. three. Yeah. A one and two P. And one is half two, right? Yeah. Number one is half two, right? So this is the right answer. Thank you, Ali. Jazakallahu khairan. Okay, now I need Sama. Can you open your mic, Sama? Yes. Yes. Why are you closing the camera? Yes, I can see you now. Now look at look at this fraction uh, uh, or at, at this ratio, Sama. It's six to eight. At we, uh, at which grade you are, Sama? Miss, you say six. six. Sama Umana. Great six. Sama, I said Sama, dear. I said Sama. Yes, great six. That's good. Now I need you to look at this uh, ratio, Sama. Six to eight. Six to eight. Can you tell me how can we make it at the simplest form? Okay. You attend, huh? First, we can say that six to two, uh, uh, Sama, it looks like six over two, the same. When you say six to two, Three. it looks like six. Listen, six to uh, six over eight. So at okay. the simplest form, how can we make it at the simplest form? Huh? The antecedent, the antecedent, the first term of ratio here is six. How can we make it at the simplest form? And the same three. with number eight. Three over uh, three to four. Three to four or three over four. That's right. The same ratio six is to eight equal to the ratio. Three is two, four. So this is the, the right answer, right? Uh, Hams, can you understand what we did now, Hams? Yes. Yes. So we use we use division and we make six divided three, six divided two, because mm -hmm. number two I can make it divisible for three six and, and eight. Two. So six divided two equal four. three and eight divided two equal what? Four. Four. So the ratio now will be three over four or three is four. four. So this is the right answer. Thank you. Thank you, Saman. Thank you, Hans. Yeah, this is the right answer. Let's see the, the, the next question. And now I need Lamar. Posted me. Okay. Okay, Miss. Okay. Okay. Lamar? Yes, Miss. Yes, Lamar. I need you to look at this question. Okay. And take. And First, we will erase this. Uh, the antecedent, repeat again, repeat again, Lamar. Antecedent. Hello, Lamar. Antecedent. Antecedent of antecedent. the. Antecedent. Of the. Of the ratio. Ratio. Huh? Four. Four to seven. Is. Four over seven. Four over seven. This this that means it's four over seven, like this. Four over seven. This is the same. When I write it like this, the same when I write it like this. This is four over seven, and this two, four over seven. This dash means fraction. Okay, so, okay, Lamar. Miss, okay. I didn't understand this question. Is this uh Sama is talking, right? Yes. Okay, Sama, please raise your hand and when Lamar finish your answer, I will tell you, okay? Four. 
the antecedent of the ratio four is two seven or four over seven. Where is the antecedent? Number four is the antecedent or number seven is the antecedent? Which one? Seven. Huh? No, number seven, we call it consequent Lamar, okay? We call number seven what? Consequent. Consequent. Yes, I need you to repeat again. This is antecedent, the first term, antecedent. Four. Yes, antecedent is, is four. What is the consequent, Sama? Open your mic and camera, please, Sama. Ali, yeah, where are you? Yeah, miss, I was actually telling you the first four. Really? Okay, okay, Lamar, I hear it, I hear it seven. Okay, so you are right, you will get the right answer. Super duper quiz, uh, uh, student. Now this is four, the antecedent, and and seven is consequent, Sama. This is this is the term of the ratio. Sama, listen, Now this is the term of the ratio. You have the first term, and the second term, okay? Number four, we call it, it's antecedent, and the second term, we call it consequent. Okay, Sama? Again, you close your camera. Okay, so the right answer will be what, Lamar? Huh? Seven or four or 11, which one is the right answer, Lamar? Four. Four. Is this right answer, Hannah? Yes, ma'am. Okay, this is the right answer. So we can choose here four. This is the antecedent of this question. Okay, thank, thanks for you all. Now we need to remember what we talked at this session. Uh, this session. Yes. Yes. And citizen. Hi, Hi, Hi. Antecedent. Antecedent. This is numerator. Okay. But if we write it like this, Sama, if we write it like this, if we write the ratio like this, we can we can call that number one. Number one is antecedent, this is the first term of the ratio, and number two is consequent, okay? And in the fraction like what you said, number four, the numerator will be antecedent, and number seven, the numerator the will be, huh? The, the numerator will be what? Will be consequent, will be what? Um, yes, super student, Allah mm -hmm. Yes. Now let's see what what we talk about today in our in our session. The ratio between two numbers one and two. If I have two numbers one and two, the ratio between these two numbers we can we can read it like this: one over two, or is one two two. We can say it what Farida. Farida. Yes, Miss. Ha, tell me, Farida. How can I read this one? One over two, two, and one to two. Yeah, one over two, one two, one two. One two two. Look at this one. One two two. This is number two. Okay, Farida. One two two. Yes, thank you, Farida. Please, Farida, we will not eat out in our session. Okay. I finish. <laughs> okay, dear. Okay, now we have. One and two, this numbers we call it term of the ratio. We call it what? Repeat after me. Term of the ratio. Term. Term of the match. I need you all, not Farida only. I need you all to repeat after me. This two numbers of the ratio, we call it term of the ratio. We call it what? Formulation. One, two, two. Ratio. One, two, yes. We one, call it what? Number one and number two. We call it what, Farida? One to two. Terms, yes, we call it terms of the ratio. These numbers, we call it terms of the ratio. Okay, Ham? Okay. Can you hear me, Ham? Miss Russia has to ask in his session. Okay, okay, okay. 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 So, and I, I should, okay, so I have these two numbers, we call it terms of, of the ratio. And the first number, as we said, it's antecedent, antecedent, 
and the second one we call it consequent. Call it what? Consequent, okay? Okay. Okay, dear. Thank you for this session. And I need to see you later, inshallah, okay? Okay. Hakalibi can have some machine. Okay. Goodbye, Miss. Goodbye, dear. Goodbye, Miss. Bye, bye, Miss. Bye, bye. Can you make me have some machine? Miss, Miss. Bye. Salam alaikum, Rahmatullah, Barkatu. Yalla. Salam alaikum, Rahmatullah, Barkatu. Yalla, bye. Smart.